Imagine you're stuck in a desert in scorching hot weather. You'll start sweating and your body will struggle to maintain its temperature. But there's an animal that has mastered the art of heterothermy, the camel. Here's what we can learn from camel biology. Camels have the same amount of sweat glands that humans do, yet their unique body structure allows their bodies to stay cool and sweatless. When a camel's body temperature rises, instead of sweating, it can let out heat from the lower part of its body where it has no fat. Only when its body temperature reaches above 40 degrees Celsius does its body produce sweat. That sweat is then mixed in with its layered fur, which is partially shed in hot months to keep its body temperature stable. Some of the fur remains to insulate the skin from the hot air and to reflect sun rays, which keeps the surface underneath up to 30 degrees cooler than the air above. Together, the sweat and fur form a ventilation method, which allows the body to shed heat through evaporation and to maintain the lower temperature for five times longer through insulation. The water preserved in the camel's body through those mechanisms is stored in special blood cells that can expand up to 2.4 times their original volume. This helps regulate blood flow and in turn, body temperature. Camels are also equipped with noses that have scroll-like passages lined with water-absorbing mucus. These passages experience changes in capacitance and serve as humidity detectors that help them find water to replenish their reserves. Camels are truly wonderful creatures and many discoveries are inspired by them, and more technologies might be discovered if they are studied more closely.